Hello everybody and it's good to meet you once again. I'm Bara Heisen Daoud from the Razorhead Gaming Tube. Yeah, I mean it's gaming group. So today I'm gonna show you and teach you how to make a great opening in chess. It's very powerful and it's an attacking. It's an attacking thing. So you start as you make the same for the black and white. I put the pawn on E4, see here. Use the horse for the here. Same thing. Then you put the bishop on c4. That guy will say, okay, let me protect the bishop on the, the pawn, sorry, on e5. So I put the pawn, protect his friend on d6. Then you put your horse on g5. Okay. The player will realize that you're attacking this point, so he'll say, "Okay, I have to move. I have to protect this pawn." So he put this pawn on, which was on d6. He put it on d5 to block your bishop. So you eat the pawn. The pawn. You have no choice but to eat the horse. Yeah. Okay. Then you sacrifice by putting your horse. On F7, sacrifice is really, it's really awesome and will help you a lot. But it's very difficult to, what can I say? It's very difficult to to master it because it's not that easy to think m more than one move at a time. So I put the horse on F7. The player will be so happy. He's gonna eat it because if he won't eat it, you can eat the the queen or the castle so you eat it you put your queen on f3 <coughs> then uh, I almost forgot yeah then if the person is really stupid he put the or he's a beginner let's not use stupid he's a beginner he put their he put the king and g8 but but if he's if he knows how to play, he probably put it um he put it somewhere else. I think on e8 or e7 or e6. So if he does and put it on g8, then he's done because you can eat the horse with your bishop and the, you block your bishop with his bishop. You eat it with the bishop and checkmate thank you for watching and please subscribe